Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best CPU for gaming. Starting at number 5. Intel Core i5. The 12th generation Intel i5 Alder Lake processor does what people were expecting from Rocket Lake and actually dethrones AMD Ryzen 5000 series for a competitive price to performance ratio that's hard to argue against. Comparing the Intel Core i5-12600K with the less than well-received Intel Core i9-11900K, the 12600K actually outperforms it for a fraction of the cost. Indeed, its documented performance means it more than deserves a high spot in our roundup but misses out on that top slot for one simple reason, the 13600K is unreal. Regardless, one of our editors has this as their CPU of choice, and it's handled gaming and benchmarking with an RTX 4090 with absolute ease. If you like the look and feel of the 13600K but don't want to splash out as much dough, this isn't too far behind. Coming at number 4. Intel Core i7. Before there was a Raptor Lake refreshed Intel Core i7, there was a Raptor Lake Intel Core i7. While we're just about to start testing the 14th gen version of this processor, at this point in time, it's hard not to recommend the 13th gen model. It'll likely start to get cheaper now there's a new wave or Intel chips, and the performance it nets you is no short of ridiculous. The 13700K has 16 cores, only two more than the i5. These are made up of 8 performance cores and 8 efficiency cores. In terms of threads running through these cores, you have 24 for more than the i5. So the real question remains, do you actually need this extra headroom for the money? For most people, we'd still recommend the 13th Gen i5, but for content creators looking for that extra peace of mind, that extra headroom does make a difference when gaming at higher resolutions and settings. At number 3. Intel Core i9. Intel's 13th gen flagship CPU is a powerhouse that few will need, but if you're going to go for a top-of-the-range processor from the last few years, this is the sweet spot. Yes, the 14th gen core ultra equivalent will likely give you better performance, but this is the one you'll get better value from in terms of price. The specs separating the latest model are few, so you really are getting the best deal with the Raptor Lake version. This i9 sports a whopping 24 cores and 32 threads, which is enough to make even the busiest of workloads weep. With that amount of headroom, there just isn't anything that'll make this CPU struggle in gaming, content creation, or anything else you have in mind. We've seen the sorts of performances that come from the lesser i7 and i5 in the Raptor Lake wave, and they were plenty for most gamers to get by on. If our review of this flagship is anything to go by, nothing will stop you with this i9 house in your rig. Number 2 of my list. AMD Ryzen 5. The AMD Ryzen 5600X may not blow anyone away with its sheer power, especially with AMD's 7000 series on the shelves now. But as far as AM4's last generation chipsets from the company go, it's very hard to beat in terms of price. What's more, the 5600X is frequently on sale, down from its already competitive $260 MSRP. The AMD Ryzen 5600X is a solid all-around performer with both its single-core and multi-core capabilities in-game, too. That's due in part to this CPU's higher-than-average clock speed combined with its quiet yet cool operation over extended periods of time. If you're after a processor to keep your rig ticking over at its best, then the 5600X continues to impress across the board. And number 1. Intel Core i5. The Raptor Lake Intel Core i5 processor is an absolute powerhouse that should really make us question what we deem a mid-range CPU to be these days. Packed with 6 performance cores, 6 efficiency cores, and 20 threads, on paper this is essentially a cheaper and more efficient 12th Gen i7. In gaming, benchmarking, and content creation, this CPU barely broke a sweat, and doing both at the same time barely used up to 15% of the CPU's capacity. That's so efficient that I thought there was something going wrong during testing, because an i5 definitely isn't expected to be this powerful. 
If there are any flaws to note here, it might be that there's no Turbo Max 3.0 here that's reserved for 13th Gen i7 and i9 processors. Like the others in the Raptor Lake bunch, this CPU can be a tad more power-hungry than you might like, and it can run hot under stress. Rest assured though, the i5 gives you the best all-round package in these regards, and won't be nearly as extreme as an i7 or i9. When you take price to performance into account, there really isn't any beating this CPU without moving to the AMD side. For the absolute majority of players, money shouldn't be wasted. An Intel Core i5-13600K is all you'll need for gaming this generation. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.